Ninja Wizard Simulator. Sounds like a kid's dream, right? Well, this odd choice of a game exists. Created in 2019 by the developer Peppersicle, this odd game focuses on many different tasks. Today, we are going to review this game. Are the ideas too jumbled? Does the combat system work? Let's find out in our second episode of Game Review. Let's ninja backflip into it. Yo, what's up, hashtag nerd squad, and welcome back to another video. Before we get started, thank you to my Patreon supporters, Bitback Gaming and Birds and Turds. Also, thank you so much for the support on the Coral video. Your support means more than words to me. Thank you guys so much for 450 subscribers. Alright, enough stalling. Let's get into it. To review the games, we must take into account three factors in which I usually review games. Concept slash gameplay, building, and scripting. To add up the total, we will review each of these categories out of 10 and then add them up and then divide the total by 3. This will create us our average which will be our final score of our game. First, let's review the overall concept. The purpose of the game is to level up your XP by training, which is done through your left icon as stated previously. However, I believe this training system is typical and provides no different and bland ways to keep the player encouraged to train. It is a repetitive action which is done through clicking. The overall score on the training is 4 out of 10. The experience truly provides a bland one. Next, let's review the building. The building in this game is set in a low polyester style, also known as low poly. This style is very simple, however, I believe it makes the map effective. Sometimes, however, I believe the map can get too big. Secondly, let's review the scripting. Overall, I believe the scripting is quite nice. So what is our final score, you may ask? Our final score is a total 6 out of 10. The game was more of an average game to me. 